Let's now use the TI-84 in order to calculate our least squares regression line. We have already previously turned on the diagnostic tool. The next thing we want to do is again make sure your data set is entered. The X's go under L1, the Y's go under L2. The same calculation we did previously when we were trying to find the correlation coefficient, we go to stat, go over to calculate, where we want to do a linear regression, that's choice four. Notice that the calculator will tell us the form. It's going to be of the form AX plus B. We go ahead and hit enter. X list is L1, Y list is L2, everything looks good. We can go down and calculate. And now the thing that's kind of nice about the linear regression, the way the TI-84 does it, is it kind of prompts us and reminds us what the equation should look like. So it's going to be a line of the form y equals ax plus b. From our standard algebra classes, we recall that a is the coefficient of x, so that's the slope of the line. And this number b is going to be the, the y-intercept. If we were to round these to four decimal places, the value for a would be 0 0.0116. And the value for B would be 5.5273. So plugging those kind of into these coefficients, the line of the regression equation would be Y equals 0.0116X plus 5.5273.